storm is faster than Finn. Finn's scared of the shadow. Finn, settle down. So look at this amazing contraption that Fiona set up. Let's look at it. So this is it. This is the design. So we got a pole here, a pole there, a pole there, and a pole here. This is good for Stella. Her with her hand, and she's going to help Finn with his mouth. So we're going to do half the lesson on our own horses and half the lesson on your horses. Wow, oh. Storm. When you You're not supposed to stand on the pole. <laughs> oh, like Dexter was that while he was walking. You're gonna need to shorten your reins and get a little more outside on. You're not using, you see his head's crooked? Like really funny crooked? Yeah. That's because we're pulling with our inside rein. Stop doing that. This seems to be the theme of the day. Reins? Yeah. Reins are gonna be the workout today. Outside leg, outside rein. Outside leg, outside rein. Ah, oh, see how he turns? Yes, yeah, but he's going to go for That's fine for now. We're working on bending. Good. Your job, I want him to ride straight like a pole. I don't want his head to have any bend for a minute. I want to see if you can make him ride a full circle without bending his neck. Without counter bending, without inside bend, just a straight pole. A little more outside range shorter. Watch, he doesn't counter bend. It's harder than it sounds to keep the head perfectly straight. Okay, now we're gonna give him a soft inside bend. So you're gonna keep the same thing and just every couple strides sponge your inside ring. So ride exactly the same as you were straight and then just add a little squeezier inside rein every couple steps. Just so he has a soft inside bend, that's perfect. He gets too much inside bend, he crooks his head off to the side and he bulges his outside shoulder and falls in. Like that. You have to support with your outside rein and leg. Keep your lower leg steady. Go circle over the four poles, please. Stay, stay on the wall there, so. You stay nice and close to the wall. Your sister will pass you on the inside. Outside leg over the poles. My toes, baby going down, 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 down. Baby going down, 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 down. Yeah. Baby, going down, 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 down. Yeah. Tried so hard to stay afloat. Yeah, we keep moving like the river goes. Yeah. Baby going down, 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 down. Yeah. 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 And I thought, it's time I'm letting you go. This time I know it for sure. I just thought I should let you know. Less bend for him. He gets his head all cockeyed. Pardon? He wants, he wants the frame, but he's getting his head all cockeyed. Showing your outside rein. Look at your hands, they're unequal. Put them side by side, and then he'll put his head down. Now just close your legs and half halt. Two hands through the corner. Outside rein, outside rein, good. Happy, lead us across the diagonal through the pylons, please. Had to get that out fast. We missed one, but that's okay. Four pylons, weave! What a good man. Your job, Gabby, is to set him up for perfect striding at every pole. Okay, to shorten your ring. Stretch up tall. Make a decision. Are you light seating or full seating? Because this hole in between stuff is not okay. I saw a lot of posting canner at the horse show. <laughs> oh God, <laughs> that hurt. But you, <laughs> 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 there was a conversation. I watched her canter to that thing. I was like, 
What in the hell is she doing? She thought you didn't notice. I was just hanging on for dear life. Uh huh. She thought you didn't notice because she told me. Shorten your reins and circle over the poles. All of them? Yeah. One, two. You gotta push him. Okay. Yeah. Set him up for success. It's not easy. One, two, three, pull. One, two, pull. One, two, three, pull. One, two, three, pull. One, two, pull. One, two, three, pull. Good. You have to keep paying attention to his striding as to whether or not to push him. If your reins were shorter and they weren't so loose, you'd have more control of your horse. Gather them up. If ever your reins are loose and you can't feel both sides of his mouth, shorten them. We're done our warm up now. You have to have contact. She's not having contact. Not at all. I think it was meant for me. Gather your reins 3,000 feet. Now go. Leg. Now he's over exaggerating because he's mad at you. One, two, three. Push, leg, leg, outside leg, outside leg, outside leg. When you lean into your outside stern, he drifts. Remember when we did that circle a minute ago and you had to keep him straight as a pole? You had to use your outside leg and outside rein. Same concept here. Outside leg, outside rein, outside leg, outside rein, outside leg, outside rein. Push him in, push him in, push him in, push. Him in. push. Him in off your left leg. Good girl. Go large. I'm dead. I'm dead. Jeez, so are we all now? Shorten your reins. Ride with your outside aid. Outside aid. There, circle up the pole. Outside aid. Into a really nice tight circle when you think about it, can't you? Gather him together. All right, challenge. Not an easy one. You have two long sides and two short sides, right? You are going to do a sitting collective canter on the short side. You are going to do a hand gallop on the long side. Oh gosh. So you have to be able to collect him and lengthen him when asked. Go. And collect. And go. Notice we nicely have poles on the rail, so it's like you're getting to a jump. That's it. I really thought we had it covered. I was gonna patch up all the scars, but we smashed up all the parts. Oh, na na na. Always knew that you were stubborn, but didn't know it'd be so hard to figure out who you really are. You know what I mean? Like yes. it's pretty packed, we just need to... Shorten your range, you can't do it without contact. Look, outside leg. You need your back lead there, Storm, thank you. Outside leg, outside leg, look up. Look up. Balance. Now tell him good. And then canter off. That's okay, good. Look up, outside leg, outside rein. Reach. Two, one. Two, one. Go. Two, one. Look up. Go large. Inside leg, inside rein. Hard to stay afloat. Yeah, we keep moving like the river goes. Yeah. Baby, going down, 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 down. Yeah. Yeah. And I thought, it's time.
Right, we just had a successful double lesson. A lot of learning. It is pouring rain now. The girls are um, cooling out their horses and I opened the gate and let the mares in because nobody, our horses don't like to stand out in the rain. So everybody's in. I'm in a little bit of pain because um, I was trying to vlog and I must have went, when I fell, I must have went whoosh, like this and then back up because when I try and put my head back at all, oh yeah, that's, that's the part that's not good. I'm just really super, super stiff. And don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.